Burton Bar Library in Central Phoenix. It's probably the last place a dyslexic kid might feel comfortable. But here, dyslexic kids are displaying their artistic talents and they're demystifying the common disorder. Along the way, they're learning a lot about themselves too. The exhibit runs until the end of the month. This was the first place that I came looking for answers or trying to find, again, any book that my child would want to read. Was I came to the library and came to the children's section just in, in dire hope for anything. If we can catch one person's attention, whether it be a grandmother or a mother or even um, somebody who maybe is struggling, they're, maybe they're looking for some answers themselves. A lot of people think they have the miss. Uh, information that dyslexia is just flipping letters backwards or they may think that people are dumb or slow that are dyslexic but it's apps it's definitely uh, the misconception because you can have a very above average IQ and, and be dyslexic so, so dyslexia is a language processing disorder and it affects your reading writing spelling and math it's it's one in five kids it's 20 percent of our population I really am. I'm very proud of them. You know, they all put their heart and soul into it. It wasn't just that they showed up um, to, to work on the exhibit. They, um, it was personal to them. It meant something. And I can tell you there was a couple teary eyes in a, in a good way. Um, there were times where I, you know, would see parents and kids kind of choking up. And that was the biggest gift out of the whole thing that it, it transcended awareness and it became, um, first of all, an empowerment sort of a thing. Um, they felt like they really did something. Um, you know, this, you know, it's the smallest thing, but, it's, um, but then again, it's not. I wish we could have that everywhere, you know, in airports and hospitals so that you see the signs and that you can identify with it. I just, and I'm hoping that that'll be like a traveling exhibit that we'll be able to get it out and about and seen by more people.